Welcome guys. Please subscribe, like, and, and comment. comment. So guys, I bought my wife a 2021 Kia Seltos LX, this Kia right here. Uh, and it was a complete surprise for her. welcome so after a month with the kia seltos i love it it drives really well it handles really well it accelerates really well even though it's a lower horsepower vehicle already within the month i've had this seltos i made some modifications to it i got the rims painted gloss black um I changed the Kia badge front and rear to the Kia 3.0 K Lexus badge. Also got the front windows tinted to match the factory uh, tint from the rear. I was in between a few uh, makes and models and I ended up choosing the Kia Seltos LX uh, because um, the price point, it's a 2021, so it's in the future. The Seltos is very comfortable. Um, I could definitely see myself taking a long road trip in this car. It's just super comfortable and the steering is amazing. It rides like it's on a cloud. If you're trying to compare the different base models of the subcompact SUVs, I think the uh, Kia Seltos LX is the best looking in its class with the 17 inch rims um, and the rest of the exterior looking like a mini Range Rover. Uh, it's a really good looking vehicle. Um, then you have the Nissan Rogue S and the Nissan Rogue Sport S. They just don't look as nice exterior. There's nothing eye catching about them. The rims on those don't look as nice. They don't look as sporty. Same thing goes for the Hyundai Tucson SE. The rims aren't as nice either. Uh, exterior has nothing eye-catching about it. Oddly enough, I look at the steering wheel of a vehicle. Kia steering wheel is really nice. There's a good uh, amount of buttons on the steering wheel. Um, this, the design is nice. The Nissan Rogue and Rogue Sport have a really nice steering wheel as well. It looks really sporty. So those are two pluses for both vehicles. The Hyundai Tucson v uh, steering wheel it's really old and plain looking. It looks like it belongs in a minivan. The Mazda CX-5 steering wheel was really nice as well, but that was not an option for me. Between all the base models, uh, this Seltos definitely handles the best. It accelerates the best. It has a nice ride, uh, very smooth over potholes. You can go over them with ease, speed bumps, no worries. When I test drove the Nissan Rogue and Rogue Sport, I'll give a Rogue Sport as an example. It's 141 horsepower um, and I believe 141, 147 pound feet of torque. Putting that car into sports mode did not make a difference. It did not help its case. I pressed the gas down all the way and I was begging for that car to move. Trying to merge onto the highway would be difficult. Trying to switch lanes quickly would be difficult. That car did not go anywhere. Acceleration was horrible. Uh, power is horrible. That name Sport inside of Rogue Sport is primarily there just for the looks of the car and just because it's a small agile car, but it is not quick. The regular Rogue, same issue. It's bigger, still doesn't have a great amount of power. And when I press down on the accelerator, even in sports mode, the car just did not go anywhere. Both cars, you press it down and it just gets stuck at a higher RPM and it just doesn't go. One of the downsides of the Seltos LX is that it doesn't come with any standard safety features. There's no blindside monitoring. There's no braking assist. Uh, there's none of that. Uh, the competition 
trim levels may come with one or two, um, uh, but the Seltos LX has none. Um, but it does make up for it in some ways that the ride is really smooth. It's great to handle and easy to handle. The rear view camera is really clear, although it doesn't have any sensors. Uh, it has a parking uh, lane assist uh, within the camera. Also, the uh, visibility in this vehicle is great. Uh, you could see through the back window and the small third back window that the Seltos design comes with. The Seltos is the perfect size for me, my wife, and my almost born baby daughter. So, you know, starting a family and everything, this compact SUV is the perfect size, uh, has plenty of space for everybody, plenty of space for your cargo. Overall, I love the Seltos. I love the choice that I made to getting this vehicle. Um, definitely, like I said, better looking than the, the competition, uh, better handling than the competition, um, and the price point is great. Thank you guys for watching. Um, please remember to subscribe. I'll come out with more content.